What's going on everyone? Moose here, Air Guns of Michigan, and today I want to revisit a video that we've talked about in the past, but I often think that we need to really, really, really focus on this topic. I really, really, truly do, and that is on cleaning the barrels of your air guns, specifically your big bore barrels. Now, leading is a serious issue that all of us run into with big bores, um, especially, um, you know, when we start shooting a lot, a lot of rounds and uh, things of that nature. So one thing that I really enjoy using on my big bores are the uh, Hoppies Bore Snakes. Now, this is not the end product of what I'm going to use on my big bore. Um, I do have a uh, Air Force Texan 257 that I recently acquired and um, I needed to get a bore cleaner for it. So I went ahead and ordered one of these uh, online uh, as my local store was out. But I want to show you guys kind of what I um, end up doing with my uh, with my hoppies um, or snakes to make them safer for uh, my air gun use. Oh my goodness, it's time to sharpen the blade. I open up way too many cardboard boxes with that thing. So, <laughs> but um, basically, uh, for those of you guys that have never used a boar snake, um, you've got this long patch or long twisting, you know, kind of, I don't know, piece of cloth, right? And then you've got this long, uh, weighted rope that you can send down the breech and out the end of your barrel and then you pull this through your air gun barrel to clean it. Now if this was for a firearm um, I would not do anything to it. However for the air gun it's actually got these uh, brass brushes built into them right right here in this little center section here um, so this actually goes through and kind of scrapes out lead like in a powder burner however I don't want to have that happen with um, my air gun so what I do is I actually go in and I remove them and how I do that is um, I simply uh, just kind of fold it over onto itself and it, it takes a little bit of time and a little bit of patience but if you just kind of work at it and work at it kind of pulling um, the the uh, cloth down the end of it and then grab yourself like a little pair of you know like some kind of needle nose pliers or in this case I use some side cutters and just kind of work this out a little bit like I said it takes a little bit of patience they're, they're tight in there and it's got some good grip. You can pull that thing right out of there. So now, now I've got a boar snake that will go through and pull all that junk out of my barrel without causing any damage. So this is kind of a two-fold video. Um, we're checking out the new uh, Sony um, A-series camera, Alpha series camera. Uh, for doing some video recording, so I wanted to see how it would turn out. And I figured this is a great way to show you guys this, uh, as this just came in the mail, and I figured we'll go ahead and get this going. So, um, you know, I use Super Quick Clean uh, Gun um, Cleaner, and what I'll do is I'll generally, like, soak, like, like maybe the first third of the rope in the Super Quick Clean Um and then I'll drag it through the barrel, drag it through again, drag it through again, and then let it sit, and then pull it through again to uh, get rid of all of the uh, stuff on the inside. So with that being said, that's a quick tip from Air Guns of Michigan. I'm Moose. Be good to each other, and God bless.